what, what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Amber Rose told her Instagram followers that her son Sebastian, whom she shares with Wiz Khalifa, begged her for a year to dye his hair blonde like his mommy's. She said that now that he's almost five years old, she finally relented so that she could see a smile on his face. These are her words. LOL, begged me for a whole year to dye his hair blonde like mine, so we started with a little patch, and I told him when he turns five, I will make him a full blonde like his mommy. He will be five on the 21st of February. He's so happy, and none of you dirty little trolls can take that away from him or me. P.S. Love your children unconditionally and let them be creative. This world would be a better place. Okay, got no problem with that. Love your kids unconditionally. Uh, we're going to be a better place. Gotcha. Here's the deal. We want to see child happy. We all want to see our kids happy. We want to do everything in our power to see our kids happy. What if for your kid to be happy, your kid said, hey, mom, I want to replace my vegetables with junk food or what if your kids say hey mom I want to smoke weed can I try some weed or some cigarettes can I drink alcohol can I go to the club which I know they won't let me in but can I sit in the car and wait on you you know there's a number of things that kids want to do and as a parent you have to step in. That's why they call them guardians, because you have to try to guard your kids. You, you know, you guard them, you know, and you guide them, right, it, into the path that they need to go. And so when they get off path, it's your job to correct them, right? See, this is the whole thing about being an adult. So kids, they're going to go as far as you let them go. Some little girls I know, they want to get belly rings they're like eight years old seven years old some of them are 10 or 11 what's the age what's an appropriate age for your daughter to get a belly ring or let's say they want to get a tongue ring or what if sebastian go to his mama today and say oh, uh, hey mama i want to get that tattoo I would go out on a limb and say that most people love their children, but unconditional love does not mean that you allow your child to do anything that he or she wants to do, regardless of consequences, just to see a smile on their face. Some people had a problem with the kid hair being dyed blonde. They were saying, oh, Amber Rose got an identity crisis, she's trying to be white. I don't have a problem with the blonde hair, just like they don't have a problem with white folks who are blonde dying their hair black. The problem that I saw was that the kid hair is probably going to be damaged because of the dye, right? And uh, Dr. Sajal Shah, a New York dermatological surgeon, backed me up on this. She said, I really don't think it's safe to dye or bleach a child's hair until after puberty, and ideally not until their late teens, at least 16. Here's the deal. Children tend to have much finer hair than adults. And since hair dye and bleach can be damaging, a child's immature hair is much more susceptible to damage. Because kids' hair goes through so many changes from birth to puberty, Dr. Shaw warns that their hair and skin, for that matter, are more sensitive and therefore more likely to experience reactions. At the end of the day, there are certainly worse parents than one who chooses to dye her child's hair. Her child, her choice. No more talk. What, what the ladies talking about?